Hey guys and welcome back to Production Line and we having to once again try and fucking build all of this back because it's your fucking game. Right, fit a steering wheel. Um, fucking annoying. Fit the steering wheel. Okay, so is that the last time we're done? Fit the steering wheel. Yeah. Okay, so then fit the lights, fit the horn, fit the seats, fit the windscreen. Put the aircon, put the electronics, we'll wallet check, conveyor all of these motherfuckers up. Okay. And be very careful about hooking up resource conveyors, because the more you hook up, the more cash you're going to fucking spend. Alright, you want to hook up one at a time. Hook up one, let it do whatever it wants to do. Then hook up the next one. Let that do whatever it wants to do. And just keep going like that. Make sure you've got enough cash. I want like about 50 grand in reserve. Before I hook up anything else. Alright. Because the more sections you hook up, it moves other pieces on which then need to buy other pieces for more cars and stuff, so... Whatever. Let's do that. Um, You go there. Buy all the little bits you need. Right, we're at 90 odd grand. Okay, and this is the one that's going to like kick everything off. Okay, I just hold. I was as far as I was wanting to bring this area. Okay, nice, got max power drying. That's good, that's good, that's good. Uh, let's grab more robots. Okay. Yep, there we go. Just gonna shove all the aircon and stuff in. Oh, we're actually getting to a point where we're needing a bit more power. It looks like we're buying a lot of power. Alright, let's get another... ...couple of power plants on the go. Let's get even more robots. Right. It was there. Okay, and then the rest of it's gonna have to 
come from this resource importer here. Shit myself because everything started to get greyed out and I was like, oh crap, how much cash have we actually got? What's your importers? Wow, okay. Oh, okay, we managed to sell a car there. It's fine. I did not expect that to cost nearly that much. It was 50 odd thousand for that. We've got so much stock just sitting on the floor right now. Nice, 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 nice. Let's get robots galore. Yeah, one of the things that I do want to do though is get um, right, fit front axles, no upgrades, no upgrade. Uh, no, that's the vehicles. I don't want the vehicles. Uh, ah, there we go. Don't really care about the speed of these because everything's going to be held back by the stuff a bit further down. So that's, I mean, that's five seconds there. Four point five, four. 4.3 8 for the fuel tank, so if we get those, that takes it down to 7 and those takes it down to 6 so if we get even whatever the fuck the next ones are called, even our robots galore then that should take it down even further so let's wait for that then 70 percent I like how this little thing is keeping us in check right now while we're waiting on this fucking beast. I mean, it would cost me like 500 grand. I was going to say I could just like put another one of these in. It probably wouldn't be that bad. I like that we're making the vast majority of this stuff though. Like for the start. There we go, robots go sweet. Uh, let's get the high pressure paint nozzle as well. Okay, so this no, no this fuel tank here. That last one didn't really do much for us. Uh, considering, so six point five is the the highest there. Oh, well that's where you put the aluminium body in. Alright, we should probably get that upgraded then. Ah, uh, seeing that, there's going to be a lot of stuff that we can shove on. Right, the trunk. Nothing there. Front bumper. Nothing there. Rear bumper. Bottom trim, nope. Making sure that we're not like missing anything. That the rear arch will have anything then, or I don't think the vent, no. Anything special with that? Sunroof, panoramic sunroof, no. Door panels, wow, okay. Lots of stuff in door panels. Nothing for the windows. I don't think anything was like. Oh, the roof was, yeah. 8, 7. 7.35 is probably the longest then. Uh, wing mirrors, nothing. Ain't the undercoat. There's nothing that I can do to that. Dry the undercoat, however. 21 seconds, 20 seconds, 18 seconds, that's pretty good. In the finish, by the finish. But one second, 21 seconds is how long it's going to take me to make these just because, unfortunately.
no, no, no. None of these. I got a spare wheel. Hey, high pressure pit nozzles. Uh, the rest of it's all stuffed down here, I think. Extra robots. I think now that I've got the extra robots, as long as I can get everything that. Let's see here. Aircon. Ah, I don't need the extra robots, whoops. The two speaker, voice recognition, the sat nav. What I could do with the extra robots. Yeah, it brings it down to five point something things. Alright. Resource conveyor from here, basically. There we go, and I don't know why it does that, it's really annoying. Alright, we're at 160,000. Thing is, this still isn't going to go fast just because of the paint drying. Fucking paint drying. Well, this is my first attempt at a full production line, and it's not really going to work for us because of the paint drying, unfortunately. But, I mean, after we get that got, uh, on the go, we should be able to buy, like, this big section and get it done properly with, like, ratios. Hey, aluminium bodies done. Let's get faster conveyors. Why the fuck not? Ooh, shit. Okay, we're now spending an awful lot of cash. Because I hooked up something that I wasn't expecting. I do not want to do that. Um, Jesus, that's a lot of cars. Well, it's going to get to the wheels and it's going to stop. So that's kind of helpful. Okay. That's the thing, every new one that you plonk in just it adds a lot. Um Let's get a power tailgate sure. Okay, it looks like we just managed to weather the weather the storm there. The thing is, once I get these last sections hooked in, it's just going to be mental. I want maybe 150 grand before I pick up any more sections. So you can see the, the evolution of the car from nothing, like, all the way up to getting painted, like, undercoat. Final coat to the wheels getting fitted. It's gonna kill. 134, let's hook up the next section. Move it all up by one.
it's like this next bit, it's the brakes. Once I do the brakes, everything kicks off. Worst comes to the worst, I'll sell some, uh, I'll sell some researchers, research things. If we don't manage to get down here in time. We went down 84. Alright, new research project. We just got powered tailgate. I should get some of the manufacturing things. Let's just get a high speed conveyor belt, sure. This is going to be called the shit. Casual 20% on top of it. Let's see how many shits we can sell. The shit. We've got the epic and the shit. The shit goes for just slightly above the epic. I was got air conditioning. Thing man. So it gives it the extra 300 bucks or whatever it is. I would like one of the shit, please. No quality boost, no brand boost, no, no fuck all. I don't even think the, these have got anything now. There we go. We should start making crazy fucking dough right now. And unfortunately, it's this that's choosing, or rather, it's that that's causing every. Oh my god, look at our cash. Well, let's get some more research offices on the. on the shizzle right now. the stuff just getting used everywhere. Oh, we sold, managed to sell a couple, I was worried there. For a second. Power plant efficiency, sure. How fast is these researchers going though? Pretty quickly. Pretty quickly. Alright. It's the fucking... the drying, man. It's literally just the drying. 18 seconds, 21 seconds. That's the thing that's causing everything to wait. 21 seconds worth of drying. Alright. Um, I want... I want absolutely everything researched by the time that I uh by the time that I want to buy this area and make like a proper fucking ratioed set up to this. Hey, we've got some safety features unlocked, nice. Anti lock brakes. There we go. <laughs> it's like 
you look at the money, oh, I don't quite have enough money, then you look at the cars that you've got and you're like, okay, I could, uh, I could do this. But unfortunately, that's all we've got time for in this episode. So as always, thanks a lot for watching. I've been Steve, you've been awesome. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.